Good morning. Just wanted to show you my pull shifter. This is an alloy case jammer. It uses a hand cut front lens, which I cut out myself. Uh, it's quite important on this model to have really good filtering on the front lens. It's actually got five different methods to um, to cancel out the ambient light and the environmental IR light and just let through the laser light. So this is an IR camera so you will see the laser lighting. Uh, it's quite an old speed gun, very reliable as you see. Hang on. See the laser beam there? It's a very narrow, just a few radians beam. It's literally, this range it's literally like quarter of a millimetre, half a millimetre in size. But I'll try and hit it. Uh, it's got an LED cabin alert here, basic LED, but you can also use it with a any proprietary decent laser radar detector. Uh, I used Cobras myself, they're uh, not overpriced and they seem very sensitive despite what I'm saying and trying to tell you. I'll just give it a quick flash with a gun. Say it's as in other IR demos, we don't always jam at this range, but we'll give it a whirl. I've got a web. Um, IR jammer video on my website from an American guy and even the old leader tech didn't jam at this range and that was like a 15 17 watt jammer this is set around about 10 watts using the Ram laser I'll just give it a quick flash for you just so you know no it does do something it does do what it's advertised to do there we go it's a pretty damn bright see I can't see it in IR with a human eye but I can see the IR, uh, I can see the 10 millimeter candle alert LED lighting quite brightly. You won't see that because it's drowned out by the bright Osram infrared. There we go, let's see. Pretty damn effective. I can hold it on for, for a little while. So the cop gets your speed in 0.3 of a second, so these laser detectors, radar detectors, Although they tell you you're going to get a ticket, they don't give you any breaking time as a rule. We've got a hiccup then on the gun. See, it's pretty damn bright. Even the, I've got a small filter on the gun to hold the power down with being close. Even so, it's, the response is quite dramatic. As you see. So that's an Osram laser at very low current. We don't want it light in the room really. We want it to be fully icy. So there you go. That's an Osram laser jammer with pulse shift technology. And there's another one there we've got ready for a Canadian guy. So all the best guys. Uh, take a look at the website if you're interested. As I say, a bit limited on demos at the moment, but it is, at current prices anyway, it is only £140, which is US$185. US dollars. But have a look at the updated prices. Okay, see you guys. Bye-bye.